Tiger around Lawrenceville, Senior Master Mostella here, and since it is street week, I'm in my regular clothes, and I wanted to discuss standing in base for Technique Tuesday. So, got Technique Tuesday, yesterday we went through ground stuff, uh, those, that issue for street week, and we talked about standing in base, and I just want to make sure that everybody has got that. So, the whole concept behind standing in base is basically when you normally stand up, people mostly tend to do this. Well, the problem with that is there's nothing behind me supporting me. So if I try to get up, first of all, it's very easy to get kicked in the face, get hit, whatever. But it's also just easy to push me back down because there's nothing back there stopping me from falling. Now, the idea of standing in base is to keep yourself protected and to be able to get back to your feet without easily being knocked down. So the way I teach this, I actually teach it to my Tiger Cubs all the time, but do feet in front, hands in back, drop one leg, other hand up. When I say other hand, I mean opposite to whichever leg you drop. So now my setup in this position, if you're looking from the side, I've already got a hand behind me. I'm distanced, I'm not in that position where my face is up front, I'm distanced already with this hand guarding me. So from here, I want to be able to actually lift and hold. I can actually throw a kick if I needed to at somebody's knee or something like that, but this is my position here. You can kind of swing back and forth. Your knee points down at the mat or at the ground and then you bring your foot behind you and it comes behind the hand and stand up. One more time, feet in front, hands in back, drop one leg, other hand up, lift, swing your foot under and behind your other hand and stand up. That is standing in base and that is Technique Tuesday. Can't wait to see you on the mats.